There's one more article that was published uh, yesterday uh, on glutathione from Washington State University. And it, let me read this to you because it's a different twist on what glutathione does. It says to reduce the risk of stroke and heart disease, some researchers are focusing on effective ways to safely lower elevated blood pressure in at-risk populations. Of course, that makes sense, right? In order to lower the risk of stroke and heart disease, you want to make sure your blood pressure is, is in a normal range, especially if, if it's elevated to begin with. It says gluteplex, whey-based protein, can significantly reduce elevated blood pressure, reducing the risk of stroke and heart disease, according to Washington State University. They report reported that whey protein yield a greater than a six-point reduction in an average blood pressure of men and women with elevated systolic and diastolic blood pressures. As well, they say, the supplementation decreased total and low-density lipoprotein cholesterol. Well, if you want to figure out one of the ways to lower LDL, you've now got something to help you, and that is, you know, eating more of, of glutathione. The team concludes at Washington State University that whey protein beverages are useful for the dietary treatment of pre-hypertension or and or stage one hypertension. So the more the more research that's being done on glutathione, the more we realize how crucial it is, not just as a detoxifier of the body, but also as a very important nutrient for maintaining balance, not only in the cardiovascular system, but in the digestive system as well. Fascinating nutrient. And when I wrote my book back in the early 90s on glutathione, I was uh, so impressed even then uh, at the amount of research being done. And now it, it's unbelievable. The research being done since that is is extraordinary.